Hey there everyone, this is Al Cow playing VLDCX, and today we're at least starting with, who knows where it's gonna go, but Missing Cleft by Prism. Paw print right there. Unbelievable. Type for a nice like whoa, we got this whole map thing. Well, I can't move on the map even though it's clearly open. Missing Cleft Oh, we got this peaceful music. And okay, oh, there was a dotted line. Oh, oh. I don't know what a cleft is, like, I- I would believe you if you told me how to do with, like, mounds or something. I know- I don't know, like, there's just something about the word, but... You no, know, like, I know, like, the medical condition of a cleft lip, so that's kind of like, a uh, uh, uh... Okay, so I guess I- it's probably a similar sort of mound formation. Man, these two blocks are closed off to me. Now I'm curious, and I wanna know... What there is to see, what a peaceful kind of vibe we're getting here. Richard is just proud to show off his beard. Alright, check it out, we're here, we're somewhere. There's clouds, they're blue, that guy is now money. I didn't get the 30 money up until now to get the prize inside the box. But I wouldn't be able to use it either, so you know what, it's fine. Not sure how you do you need like a trampoline to get up there. Oh, wait, I feel like we're getting kind of a, kind of a repeat here. Very similar structure. No, that's how nature works. Iteration. Here we go. Oh, I ducked underneath the guy with the googly eye. And then I fried a god I just wanted. Oh, oh, you can jump up through clouds, by the way. Realistic? Yes. Expected? No. But hey, you get more money here. It's a lot of, like, little incidental money prizes. Very m Nintendo, if anything. Alright, hey. Whoa, I saw that, that thing it blowed in. That does not happen often. It's probably maybe because this whole level is going right to left, which is an aberration. Like, maybe the game is just not, like, some of the blocks don't really expect that to happen. I don't know. We'll get more cloud money, zoo. Hey, buddy. How's it going? Well, you, you keep on keeping on. I'm gonna keep going through these iterations here, if you don't mind. Yeah, I could use that guy's head to bounce. I'm not, though. That's just mean. See, that guy uses his head to split. That doesn't make any sense. I did it! I bounced on this guy, and the music stopped. Just full stop. A big old Smebex loop right here, looking real pretty. I guess the author never expected that one would beat the level. I don't know, there's a whole bunch of clown things, but I just don't know how to get high enough to get to most of them. Like, is there like this a lot over oh, nighttime now? I can tell. Because there's the moon in the background. Uh, this music here is actually pretty cute. And there's a big lamb cake. It's the cake in the shape of land. Or is it lamb that tastes like cake? Yeah. The world should probably never know. I don't think it's the kind of knowledge that... There's a face in the water. There's a smiley face hidden in the waves of the water. Now that's scary. Luminous Hollow by Taylor. Here we go. This level I was made for this contest. Dragon coins are there. Extra mouths, maybe not. In the world of purple, amidst emptiness. We got more crystals. Crystals are a thing that happens more than once. <laughs> Thanks for for this uh, very important, uh, you know, analysis of the trends in this contest. Look, man, look at that shade of blue. Well, it's multiple shades working together to create, like, some kind of hyper shade. Real term, I'm an artist. That's how, that's how words work. Look at that, there's even a crystal just out of lines for that chainsaw. That guy's so happy because his daughter's named Crystal. Like, there's, there's just so many of them, and now we got a house. The most powerful of all crystals is home. Where you feel comfortable, you can just kind of like wear as little as you're comfortable with when you're on your own. And like, I don't know, man, look up animal pictures on Tumblr. Now that's what we call a Saturday night. Alright, look at this guy. Well, now you can't anymore. I probably should have kept that around. I don't know, there's a rock on my block. Ain't gonna wear my socks. I wear socks very little. True fact about Alcow. Uh, I'm the type of person that tends to be barefoot, even in places where it might not be culturally appropriate. 
I can't help it, ma'am. Comfort above all else. We only live once. And gosh darn it, I'm gonna make my one shot at life. At least comfy. If anything else. Hey, look at that. I can jump up here and... See, it looks like they're tied by ropes. Like, normally in a contest up to now, when a thing was held by ropes, they wouldn't fall, but here they did a bad job tying them and things as well. Look at that rock. Big old teal rock. Was it teal or is it just the platform in front? There's a lot of foreground here, so be careful. Hey, Charlie, watch out. You got hit by a shell. Just watch out about that. Charlie, I got fireballs. You gotta watch out about that. Well, that guy's got rock balls, so you know what? We all gotta be careful of each other. We may live in peace. Sometimes. Uh, shoot! I messed it up! I messed it up completely! I... Oh, I did a bad evaluation of what was presented to me there. I did, I did the wrong type of jump, and everything fell down. This could have been a dragon coin run, like I had three of them. But it's not going to anymore. Uh, no, the good thing though is that, like, it was, like, very close to here. Yeah, it was, like, around here. Like, you go here, this guy's got a shovel, and he's gonna show ya. He's really proud of that shovel. Alright, so here, I think, what you gotta do is you do that, then you bounce on this tiny rock, and then you get bit by that plant. I don't think the big being bit by the plant is part of, like, the... Ooh. I'm not- I'm doing this way harder than I need to, because I made a mistake. <laughs> That's just how it is. Uh, Alright, bop, there we go, look at that. Is that pipe meaningful? Well, it's meaningful because it's on the rise! Uh, Alright, so, strictly welcome to Crash Bandicoot here, timing three things together. Don't jump when the pipe is up. Alright, now I gotta do this. Without fireball, this is going to be meaningful exactly here, and that's about yeah, that's about it for meaningfulness, really. Yeah, you don't need a bounce on a rock, just, just do that. Okay, sometimes, sometimes, I'm just gonna get this gun because it's fun. All right, it's like a little last minute, like play chicken with yourself. Yeah, so, I, uh, this is... There's a lot going on at once. Yeah, just jump a little bit so it doesn't, like, go out of control. And look at that. You can just do this. You can just do that. Everyone's just being, uh, bunions on the hand of time. That's not an analogy that most would be fine with. But it's the one I made. Here we go. We're about outside. Charlie's happy. He's stuck on the rope. He's holding the rope. He's holding the rope! We don't know why! He's just having fun, man! He's having fun in his own time, his own way, his own style! And that's great! That's fantastic, man! Continue as best as you can. This is fun. This is fun. This is fun like it's not it's not a pure boppo. The worst setup is that it turns out you just you just rush. Just run. Just go for it. Thwimp Spining's Tree. The third level we're playing here by Jean Oliviera. Jean Oliviera? I'm not sure how to pronounce it. I'm very sorry. Like, this is like a real name. Like, it's a name name. It's a name you can reserve a hotel room with. <laughs> so I'm sorry, I'm, 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 I'm... There are multiple paths to pronunciation. But here we are! It's just a tree in the middle of the thing. There's a yellow switch palace here. You know what? I'll do it. I'll yellow my mellow. If this gives me a mushroom, I'm gonna take it. Like, you know, aid for platforming, it's fun and all, but sometimes people just you need a switch to get the power up, and those times I take it seriously. It doesn't say you, though, a prison thing. It's a tree! Look at that! It's a tree. Oh, it's a. Sp oh. Thwimp spiny. We're just... Alright, well, there's a real thwimp. There's a real beanie. Uh, but also, there's gonna be thwimp spiny. And, you know, it's a forest, so you can see the trees. Oh, jeez, I just jumped there. Just no real recollection. Like, it's weird, because it's like, it's strictly eggs. Oh, and more stretchy pipes. Okay. 
Like, it's- they got adult Spideys everywhere, but you just got those bopping eggs everywhere. I guess they're having trouble, like, breaking out. That's tragic. M maybe- is it? Not, yeah, if you're stuck in your helpless egg form, like, I wouldn't be particularly happy. I guess I'm ballooning now. <laughs> I didn't really expect that. I don't know if I'm gonna miss a lot of the level. But I was offered a blue, and I was like, well, okay, maybe this is for secret exit? Ballooning above the trees, I forget who I be. Um, and then here, yeah, I get, like, an additional landing zone that I don't need, really. Like, I'm not sure how anyone would really benefit from that. They can go in this pipe, and I don't know what's gonna happen now. I'm now in Cloud Town Rope Zone. We're gonna clown and rope. We're gonna play the saxophone. Follow the line and end up in an harpsichord mine. I don't know what that meant. Um, if I'm a- oh. I almost want the- you know what, if I beat the level, I think I'm going to replay it, because I just flew through most of it here. I got all the Nagadons, that's fun. And here, like, we're just in the part of the forest, where it's the forest part. There's grass and bushes and bees everywhere. Yeah, let's replay this. I didn't play most of that. You gave me a big balloon, and I was like, well, I guess I will inflate myself into a floating ball orb. That's what all the kids are about these days. And we saw the result. Alright. <laughs> Great commentary, cow cow. You did it. Ah, uh, big concentrate con cir circumstantial circles of leafage. There we go. Words are meaningless unless you decide to ascribe to them meaning. And I'm like, communication doesn't work. Let's just break it all down and start over. This time I'm going here where I get to do this. Hey, there's a midpoint. There we go. This is a short level. There have been level segments that were longer than this entire level. Yeah, and this level's gonna give you a nice checkpoint and everything. I, I feel like this level's so nice. You can get a fireball here. You can get a fireball and burn that and shoot that guy right in the face. You know, that's the kind of things you gotta expect outside sometimes. And that just jump say that guy's like, whoa, check it. I've got arcs and you know what? That's that's the pipe I went up. It's that thing up there, that's where I went up. Remember when I went up a pipe? Whoa. Ducking by accident is always fun and prosperous to no one. Alright, look at that. And this is where it come out! Alright, we have now a full map of the woods. We are ready for our camping trip to North Dakota, DC. Five, uh, the new frontier, Apple Glide. Just put your card in the slot and swipe it all up, and then a clown shows up and goes, What up? I feel like some that's something I want to avoid, though. 